Freddy. This is Chris from MarketSwingTrader.com. This educational video is about candlesticks. So what we're looking at now is what's called the Japanese candlesticks. Now there are many types of different candlesticks and one I'm going to show you now is called the Western style which is the bar. Now the bar chart, I don't like it because it's hard for me to read the sentiment of the market and what is going on. But right here, if we take this bar right here, we have an open, we have a low, we have a high, and we have a close. So I don't like using the bar chart just because it's hard for me to gauge the sentiment of the market and read what is going on. So I like using Japanese candlesticks. Now on a candle you have the open, the high, the low, and the close. So if we look at this chart here, we have the open which is here, we have the high, we have the low, and we have the close. So with that, we have different things in the candle which are called the wick and the body. Now right here, from here down to here is called a wick. And from here to here is called a wick. Now the body of the candle is from here down to here. That is the solid green or the solid red from here to here is called the body. Now this right here, this is considered a long wick right here to here. And this candle here was a down day because we opened up here, we traded the high of here, we traded a low, and then we closed lower than where we opened so it's a red candle. And that is just the basics of candlesticks. And there are different types of candlesticks. You have hammers, you have shooting stars, you have bullish engulfing, bearish engulfing. You have what are called dojis, uh, spinning tops. You know, these are things that I would go in detail in the future. Uh, but right now, you just need to understand the candlesticks and what's an up day, what's a down day. Now this is on the daily chart and candlesticks work on even if we switch over to a 15 minute chart they work the same way. On the 15 minute chart if we look uh, back here as you can see like right here if we look at this candle right here, we had an open, we had a high, we had a low, and then we had a close. That was a nice up day. So, and let's say we take this candle here, we opened up, and then we just sold right off for the first 15 minutes down to here, which is the low, and then we closed lower than where we opened. So it works on different time frames as well, as well or as on weekly. You can have the weekly candles. We had an open, we had a high, we had a low, and we had a close. So BlackRock for this week closed up higher. Let's go back to the daily. Now that is just the basics of candlesticks and how to read them. And I will go in further detail with more educational videos with the different types of candles and what they all mean. So thank you.